According to the CDC's data tracker, the level of community transmission of COVID-19 on the Treasure Coast is high. The positivity rate for the last seven days, ending with July 31st, in Indian River County, a little more than 19.3 percent. Martin County, 21 percent. St. Lucie County, 24 percent. At this time, this could have been prevented. Clearly, this could have been prevented. Had people just taken their vaccines. Dr. Moti Ramgopal is an infectious disease specialist in St. Lucie County. He says over the weekend, local hospitals were filled with COVID-19 patients, and most of those patients were unvaccinated. He says some in the medical field are also unvaccinated, and that's puzzling. I would sit with them and have these discussions, and the questions come back as they're afraid of the vaccine. They're afraid, they're afraid. Where did we go wrong is a question I keep asking myself. How did we allow this fear to be conquered by the misinformation rather than by clear information. Steve Forbes says he's unvaccinated and he's still trying to decide if he should get the shot. I'm trying to hold back because I want to see exactly what, what's going on with this vaccine before I try to take this. But now with this, this new variant coming out, I might decide to go on and take the vaccine. We reached out to several health officials who say as the hospitalization rates continue to rise, they've also seen a slight increase in the number of people who are now getting the vaccine. Still, they say as we wait for more people to get the shot, they're encouraging everyone to not get complacent. If there's one thing we need to do right now for us all to get back to wearing masks for the next four to six weeks until this pandemic slows down. If there's, if there's one clear recommendation, if you're, if you're saying, okay, I'm afraid of the vaccine, I really don't want to take it, then wear a mask. Protect yourself, protect your family, protect the people around you. And officials say that they have several events planned for this week and this weekend where folks can just walk in and get the vaccine. Reporting live in St. Lucie County, Angela Rozier, WPBF 25 News.